everybody it's tina here from tina's talk time this video is going to be a bit of a mismatch um i don't think you can say odds and sods but it's an odds and sods type of video i'm not sure whether the youtube allow that but i've said it anyway <laughs> uh, what it is um well i started to do i thought last week i'd do a vlog so um, I did sort of this car vlog on the way to Cleveland's. I had to pick something up from Marks and Spencers. It was some things that I'd ordered in the sale uh, for the haul. You know, when we did the um, clothe the spring haul. Um, anyway, uh, they didn't come in time. Um, well, actually, what happened was they did come in time, but they then further reduced them by quite a lot. Um, I think they'd originally got 25% off and then they put 40% off. So I reordered them. But anyway, they came too late. So it was all my fault. But I will show you those. Perhaps in, I'll perhaps do a video tomorrow because there's something else I want to talk to you about, which is the Aldi dupes that are in store this week. Um, but I don't know if I'll have time to fit it into this video. Anyway, to cut a long story short, I did this car vlog on the way to Cleveland. I was going to take you up the promenade on the way back. But um, I shut my handbag in the boot, the car and my phone was in it, so I didn't do it. Um, then uh, we went out for a meal for Sunday lunch with my daughter and family. Um, and what I did was I just took some photos of the meal. That they're not for being shown on YouTube. So, <laughs> so uh, I, I just took some photos. It was, <coughs> excuse me, it's um. It's like a, a pub style restaurant um, called The Eagle at Wheaton. Years ago, it used to be called The Eagle and Child. Um, but um, the food is so good. I'll just sort of put a few shots in of, of the food. And then the other thing, of two other things actually. So we'll see how long this uh, goes on for. I've got um, a home bargain haul. Now, I don't often do this sort of home bargain haul, but some of the things I thought were so good. Um, I thought I'd show you them. Uh, I just nipped in home bargains this afternoon. By the way, if you like this top, um, it's quite a long top. I don't think you can see it. Um, I bought it from Next, oh, perhaps about a year ago, but it's now in the Next clearance sale and it's only £15. And I think I paid 30 for it. And it's been quite a useful top, you know. Um, just thought I'd throw that one in. <laughs> anyway, um, so I've got that and then I got some garden light scent. Now, I told you before we get offered all sorts of things and this sort of thing I probably wouldn't have normally accepted. I mean, I did at the beginning uh, when I first started doing YouTube because to be quite honestly, you're that thrilled that somebody's sending you something to review that, you know, um, you perhaps review things that you perhaps now wouldn't review. Anyway, these are lovely garden lights and my my thoughts were, you know, my son's getting married and he's having um, uh, the wedding in the garden, and I thought, oh, they might be, they might want these lights for in the garden. So I thought, oh, I'll accept them. You know, they'll be nice in the garden, and they are beautiful lights, but they don't want them, so <laughs> they'll be going in my garden. So um, anyway, I'll insert the footage now of the vlog bit I did last week, and then I'll I'll go into the home bargains haul. going to wear the you know the pink jacket and the uh, navy dress that everyone I like best and everyone else seemed to like best I'm going to wear that hope the weather's not like this um, but um, I thought I'd pick them up and then I can show you them because they are still in the sale it's quite a, uh, 
a good reduction as well. I'll, I can't exactly remember how much they were. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to nip into Aldi because they've got, um, I don't know if they'll have them in store today, they've got some new products out for um, Mother's Day. Now I tried to order them online but I couldn't order them online. Um, so I, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, uh, I'm going to go this way actually. What I'm going to do is just see if they've got them in store and I need some more dog food. My dog, uh, Betsy, loves the old dog food. Um, I don't know why, it's a favourite. <laughs> and she's run out of trees, which is a tragedy for her. I've put the uh, camera on this way because I look ridiculous. I've got a hat on. <laughs> which I very rarely wear, but it, it's so um, damp, I would say. keeping warm and staying in. There's lots of snow about, isn't there? It never sticks here. I don't know if it's a sea air or, or what, but it, it, I can't, well, very occasionally, it only stays for about a day or so. I think we did have some just before Christmas, you know, when everybody got lots. We just had a little bit, it was very icy. Because, do you remember, I bought all those, um, two pound items for uh, the Christmas coffee morning at the bowling club. I've been buying them all year. Um, things I've got in the sale. Some really nice things that I managed to pick up for two pounds. I was going to have like a two pound secret Santa where I was going to let everybody I was going to do a draw for them all. Well anyway the Christmas coffee morning got cancelled so <laughs> they've never got used so I've got this great big bag of them which I presume I'll have to save until next Christmas. So they're taking up a lot of room that I could do without. And it looks like I need new windscreen wipers. One of my windscreen wipers looks like it's split. I don't think you can see it. But you know, it's lovely seeing the spring flowers. There's quite a lot of camellias out at the moment. Mine aren't, but there are quite a lot. I'm going quite near the sea now. I might take you on the promenade on the way back. You see a bit of the sea. What a horrible day. I'm going to try and get the Leeds video up today. I mean, it, it was really more, more than travel through the Pennines. Oh, I love that journey. It's such a pretty journey. Cleveland's is the nearest, um, it's not a proper Marks and Spencer's, it's a Marks and Spencer's food, um, but you can pick up um, things that you order online from there. The sea is just at the bottom of the road ahead, I'm not going down that way, so... I'll have to get some new ones. I was hoping when we went to Leeds I might find the B&M's. Um, I don't think anybody watches Freya Farrington's channel. Um, well, she got from B&M's some, oh, some beautiful coasters edged in gold. Um, like a marble effect. Um, sort of a pinky colour. <laughs> well, excuse me, I've looked at all our B&M's around here and not seen them. And I thought, oh, maybe, you know, one further away might have them, but I couldn't find one in Leeds. I mean, there, there'll be loads there, but they're probably not in the city centre. And when you don't know where you're going. Right, this is coming up to Cleveland's town centre. the only places I'm going. The weather's too bad. Right here 
here's me with my hat on <laughs> ready for the snow <laughs> right i'm just going to get out now i'll take you off here i'm going to i've covered this up because i've washed my hair this morning and uh it'll be a mess if it gets wet with this so and and it's cold so i've got my hat on he got to get ahead get a hat right so i'm going in marks and spencers first to pick up my parcels and then i shall go into all day so i'll see you in a bit here i am with the home bargains haul um it's not much it's only a small one but some of the things i thought were quite nice i mean the cleaning things which i don't normally show uh things like that but i did just think i would show you them because i think they're rather nice and good value um so just let me get them up here I didn't spend that much. Let me have a look at my receipt. Oh, maybe I did spend more than what I thought. Right. Right, the first thing I got was, now I love um, Imperial Leather Original Soap. This is the original one, not the other. The reason being was that, um, I had, oh, this is really embarrassing, but I had some waterworks problems that, uh, a, while, a few years ago. I had, I kept getting infections and they told me to use this soap in that, you know, that particular area um, because you didn't want anything centred down there. And so I've used it ever since, you know, I, I just keep it for myself, obviously, you know, but uh, it is very, very good. And there's two bars in there. For, I think it was 99p. I've probably given you far too much information there. I'll be getting told off, I know, from my family. Uh, how much is that? Yes, that was 99p for two bars, and it's the original one, which is the one that's the uncentered one. So, um, so I've got that. Um, then I saw these on the way out, and it's the... Um, Fairies original, the dishwasher tablets. This, is it the dishwasher or is it? Oh, you know, I don't think it is. I think it's the washing tablets. I thought they were dishwasher, but I think they... I better read what I'm, I've bought. I don't even know. Oh, yeah, must be because they're recommended by all these washing machine manufacturers. Anyway, to cut a long story short, they were on offer. There was 14 for... Um, one ninety nine. So I thought that was quite good. I thought it was good if you were going away as well. Oh wait a minute. No, they are dishwasher pouches. I tell a lie. The dishwasher pouches. I don't even know what I bought. The dishwasher pouches, not. So you probably wouldn't want to take them away with you. Sorry about that. I don't even know what I bought. You see. Right. What's the next thing I bought? Oh, I thought this looked interesting. You know, the Vibreeze um, for the for the um, the air fresheners, the three plugins. Uh, this the two new fragrances, and one was an orange one, which I bought and I've put in my. Um, it's already in there, uh, and this one is Spring Awakening. It's the Lenore flavour, Spring Awakening. So that should be nice. So that was that was two ninety nine. Then I was going to buy um, some of the flash. I like that apple flash, flash um, anti back uh, spray. And it was, what was it? Was it about, it was two pounds something. Anyway, I just saw this one and it's called Winter Warmth. And it's a clean boost. It's a SIF one, limited edition. And this is the anti back one. I, I presume it's one they got in for, do you know, my glasses are a bit wonky. I presume it's one that they got in for Christmas or for over the winter, but it was reduced to 89p. So I thought, well, it's only like wiping down my units and that, I'll get that. So I thought that was a really good price, 89p. And then I also bought this bathroom cleaner, um, which I thought sounded interesting. It's an Astonish one and it's white jasmine and basil. I thought that sounded like it was a nice fragrance. I did actually smell it in the shop and I didn't think it was nice. Now that was really cheap as well. That was 99p. So they were really good. 
So like I got both of them for less than what the flash one was going to be. So I'll see how I go on with them. I'll let you know. So they were really cheap. Then to finish off the cleaning products, I bought this. Um, it's the Mrs. Hinge one, the Fro Frosted Eucalyptus Lenore, and it does 33 washes. But I, um, I love that fragrance and I don't think they'll have it for much longer. I'm just having a look how much it was. It was 2 49 and it does 33 washes. Probably won't do 33 washes with me. I think I'm a bit heavy handed with it, you know. So then there was just two more hair products that I got. Now, um, the first one is this, uh, I can't say, is it Schwarzkopf? Uh, it got to be, and it says too sexy, um, hairspray. I needed a new hairspray. And this is a volumizing one. Now I have had um, the got to be ones before, but they didn't have the one I normally got. So I thought I'd try that one. And that one is... Oh, no, wait a minute. 3 99 that's 3 99 And then I also got a hair mousse, which is another Schwarzkopf, if that's how you pronounce it. A keratin mousse, and it says 100% strength, supple hair, shine, boost. And that one was 2 99 Yeah, 2, oh, wait a minute, no, 2 89 so I thought they were good. So that is my little, oh no, I t I've got a couple of other things. I've actually put them in um, a vase. I bought two of these, these fake hydrangeas. I thought they were nice. They were 149 each. And then I got two sprigs of this pampas grass. I like the color. I've actually, ha oh, actually, I've actually had some of these before um, and they're 199 for a sprig. So I just got a couple of those. I've got um, a vase here. I actually got it from the charity shop. I was looking for a white and gold vase for in here. I don't know if I can show it yet. Let me lift it up. It's a really big one. Look. Now I got this from the charity shop for four pounds, which I thought was really good. I don't know whether it may have supposed to have had a lid on. I'm not too sure, but I just thought it was all right. So. I haven't sorted these out, I've just plonked them in, so don't think that that's how I arrange flowers. Not that I'm any florist like, but I've just pop pushed them in for now to get them out of the way. But isn't that good for four pounds? Often, I, I mean, our charity shops are normally very expensive, but I thought that was very good. Right, so that's all the home bargains bit. I just thought they were quite good value and um, quite nice fragrances. <laughs> so that's those. Now I'm going to show you is these lights that have been sent, these garden lights. Now these are the lights, the garden lights. Um, the G40 Global LED Spring, Strong Spring, String, string Lights. Uh, for the garden they are, uh, so they're outdoor um, LED lights I think, I think they're LED, yeah it seems like they are, and this is how they arrive, very very well packaged and they buy a company called L Gear. that's E-L-E-G-E-A-R and they're from Amazon, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put you the link in for Amazon and also there is a discount code, I'll pop that in as well, it's 10% off I think, I can't exactly remember how much they are. I'll write it on the screen, I'll find out how much they were. I think I think they were about £34, but I may be wrong. So, so they're well packaged, as you can see. Each light bulb comes in its own little pocket in there. And there are some spare bulbs, which is really good. There's three spare bulbs. Now, uh, they asked me if I'd put them up outside. Well, I'm afraid I can't. It's too cold and I'm too old. So <laughs> I said to them, I said, I don't mind lighting them inside, but I can't put them up outside. I said I'm 73. That usually goes a long way when you say that. Right, so there's three spare bulbs. They are lovely lights, these.
it's very good coming with three spare bulbs as well and that is a connector so you could you could uh, attach another set can you see how they look together so if you wanted to attach another set to them you could do um so i'll try and open them a bit and that, what i'll do is i'll try and put them up a bit in here and you can see them um but they're just ordinary led bulbs right so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to light them and i'll just pop them up somewhere so you can see them um unfortunately i can't take them out in the garden the weather's too bad and um but you can imagine how they would look um so i'll get back to it in a minute when i've put them up right so as you can see imagine these in your garden because i can't put them up in the garden at this time but look there's no other lighting in this room other than these lights aren't they fabulous they're led lights they'd look fabulous around your patio wouldn't they i mean i've just looped them around the room but there's there's no, honestly there's no other lighting in this room apart from these lights and it's dark outside so that's amazing you can see it's dark outside so how good are they? They're very good and waterproof. Excuse all the glasses on there. Brilliant. Hi, right, so all the lights are back on. Um, and so I just want to say thank you uh, for these lights being gifted. As I say, th this is the box from them. And it's a shame my son didn't want them in his garden, isn't it? But I suppose I'm the mother-in-law and I can't interfere. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put all the links of the El Gia Festoon Outdoor Waterproof Festival Lights that's what they're called it's a mouthful isn't it i'm going to put those in the description box and i want to thank the company that sent them me um yeah so i'd like to thank them and, and thank joanna who sent who, who sent them to me um so anyway that's the end of this video i think this is going to be long enough um i'll try and get on tomorrow to do wash my hair so it looks a bit better it's a bit of a mess today and um I want to show you the Aldi dupes. Um, there are some really good Aldi makeup and perfume dupes in store at the moment. I was hoping to try and get a video up today, but I just haven't had time. So I've had a busy day. I've had to go round. It was my friend's birthday. So uh, I nip round with the present for her. Then I had to post off uh, the nail varnishes uh, to the lady, the Catherine, the lady that won them. Um, so um, I've been out and about and the weather's been atrocious. <laughs> oh, do you know, I was so mad this morning because it was really sunny first thing and I did this whole load of washing, hung it all on the line and I thought, oh, it was blowing and it was, the sun was shining. And then five minutes later, these big black clouds came over. So I had to rush out and bring it all in again. So it's so annoying, isn't it? Anyway, I digress again. So I'm going to go now. Thank you for watching. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And give me a thumbs up and a share if you can. <laughs> you know how to share it, anything. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.